Hello students, welcome to the YouTube channel, Eternal AC Education. In this session, you are going to learn Chapter 4, Algorithmic Strategy, Part 7. Content of the session is Selection Sorting Algorithm. What is Selection Sort Algorithm? This algorithm repeatedly selects the next smallest element and swaps in into the right place for every pass. Hence, it is called selection sort. Pseudocode for this is, start from the first element, that is the index of 0. We search the smallest element in the array and replace it with the element in the first position. Now, we move to the next element position and look for the smallest element present in the subarray from sorting index to the to till the last index of subarray. Now, replace the second smallest identified in step 2 at the second position in an or original array or also called first position in the subarray. This is repeated until the array is completely sorted. Don't get panic. It's very easy. We'll see with the example. See the array list. 13, 6, 11, 18, 14, 15. We are going to sort this element using selection sort algorithm. Now, take the first step, 13 and 16. So this is the first element, index of 0, 16 is the next element. So we are comparing this. As 16 is small, sorry, 16 is greater than 13, so no swapping. So the first element is compared with the next element. Can you see this arrow? So 13 is now compared with 11. 11 is smallest than 13. So there is a swapping. So 11 is placed in the first position and 13 is moved to the index of second position. Again, the first element is compared with the next element. So 11 is lesser than 18. So no swapping. Again, the 11 is compared with the next element. 11 is smaller than 14, so no swapping. Again, the same first position of 11 is compared with the last position of 15. As 11 is smaller than 15, no swapping. Is it clear, children? First element is compared with each element. If it is found to be greater than the compared element, the swapping takes place or else no swapping. So, in the first step, we have placed the smallest element in the index of 0. Is it clear? Then the next step. Now, the first element is sorted. So, we can take from the second. That means index of 1. 16 is compared with 13. 13 is less. So, swap. Next one. This 13, that is the second position of that array, is compared with the Next element, 18. As 13 is less, no swapping. Again, the 13 is compared with the next element of 14. 13 is less, so no swapping. Again, the 13 is compared with the last element of 15. Again, 13 is less, so no swapping. So, here, first and second element are sorted. Is it clear and interesting too? Now, take the 16. That is 0, 1, 2. Index of 2 is compared with the 3. 16 is less, so no swapping. Again, 16 is compared with the 14. 14 is less, so swap. Now, this 14 is compared with the next element. As it is small, no swapping. Now, the element is 11, 13, 14. Up to this index value, it is sorted. Move to the next step. Now, this 18 is compared with the 16. 16 is less, so swap. Now, the 16 is compared with 15. 15 is less, so swap. Now, the element 11, 13, 14, 15, all are sorted. Fifth step. This 0, 1, 2, 3, index of 4 is compared with the next element. 16. 16 is less, so swap. 
now the sorted is sorted elements are 11 13 14 15 16 and then it is 18 so the given list is 13 16 11 18 14 and 15 so the sorted list is 11 13 14 15 16 and 18 i hope it's easy for you thank you for watching this video if you like this video subscribe this channel to watch the upcoming video thank you have a good day